We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Let me see your phone. It's bro, Let me see your like phone. So before we continue, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you're always notified every time I release a new video. Oh, sir. <laughs> of all the bad choices, this was the worst one. Because I'm an evil woman and I'm PMSing, this is not going to go well for you. All right. Men going their own way is an online community movement. Um, basically, they blame women for every single problem they have as a man. We are the head and the root of men oppression. Yes, you heard that correctly, the oppression of men. Take a minute to laugh. It's all right. I'll wait. It's anti-feminist. It's anti-women. And P.S. you broke your number one rule of not to engage with any kind of evil temptress of a woman. But yeah, here you are on my page. Sir, your biggest fear as a man is if your fantasy football team doesn't win that year. Our biggest fear as women is being raped and murdered. Because that's the same thing. So why don't you have your mama go warm you up another Hot Pocket keyboard warrior so you can get back to it and get the fuck off my page. Every man in this world and in the galaxy, listen up. Jocelyn, how may I prove my love to you? Do you ask in earnest? Yes. If you approve your love, right. you should do your worst. My worst. Do badly. Lose. No, losing proves nothing, except that I'm a loser. Wrong. Losing is a much keener test of your love. Oh. Losing would contradict your self-love, My... and losing would show your obedience to your lover and not to yourself. If a woman wants you to give up on your dreams to prove your love to her, run. Run as far as you can. Because once you give up your self-love and your passion, you have nothing to give. There's a lot of women who want to feel secure by lowering your market value. But the moment you stop following your excitement, she and other women will lose attraction for you. Jocelyn told me I should lose to prove my love. Oh God, I'd rather you were blind. This is how manipulation and control works. Warning. This can be a little triggering. This, this is a banana. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Stop calling it that. It's a banana. Look, the only reason that you think that this is not a banana is because no one ever really taught you what a banana is, and that's what I'm trying to teach you. No, it isn't. See, someone has told you that and you believe them, but you can't believe me. Why can't you trust me? I'm telling you that it's a banana. I don't care what you think or what you see. It's a banana. You can't trust me? You can't trust me that this is a banana? <laughs> you know what? You are psycho. There is something wrong with you. You see, what the manipulator and controlling person does once they realize you're not stupid is they go out of their way to make you believe that you're crazy. We're in bed, right? I'm asleep. I wake up. She's on Tinder. Texting other guys, sending other guys kissy faces, telling them to add on Snapchat. That's crazy. While in bed with me. Now, and this is no. this is also why two days ago she told me she loves me, no. right? But she's on Tinder texting other guys. She drove down no. to Iwakuni no. and was matching You're with right. guys in Iwakuni. She matched with my You're mother right. down the hallway. And you know how I know he lives down the hallway? Because I work with him. I have your things. Because you said me. Please leave. Yo, I came across this on Twitter. It's just like <laughs> two types of men. <laughs> just, <laughs> oh man. Yeah, but like my dudes, look whose number is saved though. Look whose number is saved. Hey, what's going on? What's up? You're fucked. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? You cheating on me? No. Hey, get out of my house. Get the fuck out of my house. Go on. Fucking Jody? Yeah, I bet. I bet. She's fucking your, uh, your niece now, huh? You're lucky I don't beat your fucking ass, bitch. Hey, what's your name and rank, dude? What's your name and rank, bitch? Hey, look at the camera. Look at the fucking camera. 
Yeah, you're fucked, dude. Say goodbye to your fucking rank, bitch. What color was the baby shirt, bro? What color was the baby shirt? What color was it? What color was the baby's shirt? Don't go back. What color was it? All right, ladies, it's time to get off your pedestals and stop acting like this made up fantasy world with no men would be a better place. I mean, I mean this in the most modest possible way. But a world without me? That would suck! Can I ask you women a question? What do you want? What are you looking for? I don't even know what to say what, about what I see on here. That doesn't mean I don't appreciate your beauty because there's a lot of very attractive women on here. But do you understand that you instill in men an insecurity, a confusion about how they need to be towards you? You're looking at a man who's been married twice and divorced twice against his will both times, loyal all the time, became a multimillionaire, it didn't matter. Both women left me for different reasons. One, because she just didn't feel like I fulfilled her emotional needs. The other one, because she had an affair on me. In between all that, three kids between two different women, lost their dad without them. Please help me understand you.